Hi, how are you everyone? Today's workout is Pilates Tower with uh, so we are using mostly push through bar. This workout is good for your spine mobility and the core strength. So half push through bar, so bottom load, two short blue springs on. Okay, two light uh, springs on. Then lay down on your back, put your heels on the uh, bar, okay? Then just make sure you are uh, second and third toes, middle of your ankle, knee cap, and your hip bone must be in line, hip width. Okay, then your tailbone is nicely attached on the floor. Make a nice 90 degree way. Okay, then make sure your pelvis is equal and even and flat. Your uh, hip bone, almost same height than your pubic bone and the navel. Okay, then your ribs are nicely down, melting down on the mat. Put your hands next to your hips. Shoulders are really away from your ears. Your middle of your back of your head is nicely attached on the floor. Okay, then your crown of the head is reaching back nicely. Let's do pelvic tilt here. So as you inhale, nicely engage your abdominal and pelvic floor. Okay, then as you exhale, just gently Pull your navel in and tuck your tail under. Slightly curl up your pubic bone towards your nose. And as you inhale, come back to the neutral position. Again, inhale, engage your pelvic floor and pull your navel in as you exhale. Then slightly tilt. Your shoulders and your neck and your head are nicely relaxed. Then inhale, coming back to the neutral. Again, inhale and exhale, pull your navel in, good. Then inhale and exhale, come back to your neutral position. One more, inhale and exhale, your navel is pull your navel into your spine and your lower back sinking down on the floor and inhale, come back to the neutral. Now let's do pelvic lift. Okay, so same way, pull your navel in, lower back sinking down, then curl your pubic bone towards your nose, then engage your glutes and hamstring and lift your butt up nicely, but keep your shoulder blades down on the mat, then inhale at the top. Exhale slowly, nicely, put your spine one by one back to the mat. Okay, and take your time, really feel a nice elongation of your spine. Then as your sacrum touching, coming back to the neutral position. Again, tuck your tail under, curl your pubic bone, your glutes and hamstring nicely engaged, and reach your knees nicely up towards the ceiling, tighten your glutes, and inhale and exhale slowly elongating your spine, take your time, slowly, gently come down and find your neutral position. Again, tuck your tail under, exhale and lift your butt up, peel off your spine, one vertebrae at a time, gently. Good, then reach your kneecap up towards the ceiling and inhale and exhale slowly, lower down, still nicely stretching your back. Good, then your sacrum is touching, coming to the neutral position. Nice, let's do one more. Pull your navel in and come up, 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 but still keep your shoulder blades nicely down. Tighten your core. Your sits bone are nicely engaging, tight. Then inhale and exhale slowly. Slowly put your spine back down. 
Keep your upper body relaxed and nicely stretching your lower back and coming back to the neutral. Great. Okay. Then now come a little bit close to the bar. Then put your heels on. Then press your bar up towards the ceiling. Okay. Still, you nicely align your legs. Okay. Then your tailbone is nicely attached. Okay. Gently flex your ankles and your pinky toe and big toe is facing towards your nose. Okay. Then, as you inhale, bend your knees. Okay, so your leg bone is sinking down on, into your hip socket. Then exhale, press up. Again, so inhale down, exhale straight, then and up. Inhale as much as you can and exhale up. Bend your knees nicely, still keep your pelvis flat and even. And let's do four more. Press up and bend nicely. So keep your center of your heels attached on the bar and up. And bend your knees equally and exhale up. Last one, bend, bend, bend and exhale up good now put your toes on okay gently wear the high heel okay so keep nicely pointing your toes up towards the ceiling okay still keep your tailbone down then bend your knee okay then in so exhale press up inhale bend so make sure you can see by yourself, your knees are just nicely tracking your toes and hips, okay? So control and up. Inhale, bend equally nicely. Exhale, up. Let's do two more. Bend and straight. Last one, bend and straight then now keep your legs straight then flex your ankles okay then pointing up so as you exhale flex 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 nicely stitching on your back of your legs then inhale up exhale stretch inhale pointing exhale flex 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 inhale point Still, everything is nicely aligned and flex. Feel nice, you know, weight on the uh, hips, then inhale, point. Let's do two more. Exhale, flex. Inhale, up. Exhale, flex. Inhale, up. Good. And now, heels together, toes apart, okay? Just a gentle high heel, so not too much, but slightly toes are pointing up and your sits bone are nicely closed and squeeze your inner sides together okay then as you inhale bend your knees and exhale straighten up and your inner sides are nicely squeezing together inhale down so you feel this nice wrapping motion of your glutes and exhale up. Inhale, bend equally wide knees, exhale up. Inhale, bend. So your ankles stay in the same angle. Okay, and inhale, bend. Exhale, kick up, squeeze your, your heels together too. And two more, bend and up last one bend and nicely straight up tighten your glutes good then now put your heels on and nice turn out wide okay again flex your ankles this time already pin your pinky toe is coming facing towards you okay then equally open your hips to the side then 
Benjani, inhale, exhale, kick up. Inhale, bend, exhale, keep up. So nicely widen your knees and up. Equally squeeze your glutes and exhale, kick up. Inhale, bend, exhale, up. Still tailbone is in the center and heavy down and inhale, bend and exhale, up. Two more, bend and up. Last one, so without losing this nice flexion in your ankle, kick up and slowly coming back to the center and lower your butt down with control. Good. So straighten your legs just under the foot bar, the foot under the bar. Reach your arms up towards the ceiling, nod your chin and slowly roll up. Good. Let's switch the setting. So take the uh, both spring out of the bar. From the bottom, straight up, high position on the upright. Take the uh, sec security strap, safety strap out and put this both spring on the bar. Okay. Good. So now you are sitting facing the uh, foot bar side, coming inside of the bar. Bend your knees and your both knees are together. Both big toes are together too. Then, so you're over your uh, overhand position, okay? Your elbows are nicely facing straight forward and you're sitting top of your sits bone. Your pelvis are nicely upright. Your ribs are just directly above the pelvis, nicely connected. Your shoulders are relaxed far away from your ears, okay, your crown of the head reaching up towards the ceiling. Good. Then from here, as you exhale, pull your navel in your tuck your tail under. So as you are moving, rolling back, your arms are going straight and just gently pull your navel in and roll down halfway until your circle. It's really small, okay? Then inhale at the bottom, exhale, pull your navel in and come back up. Then reach the bar up, then bend your elbows and coming back. Again, pull your navel in, roll down. Your arms are straight first, then pull your navel more and more to come down a little bit more to touch the sacrum down. Keep your shoulders away from your ears and inhale and exhale, pull your navel in and come up then at the top, bend your elbows, coming back to the starting position. Again, squeeze your inner sides and connect your inner sides, your pubic bone and navel and bottom of your sternum and roll down, good. Keep your shoulders away from your ears, then pull your collarbone wide and inhale and exhale slowly. Come up, then bend your elbows, stack back up. Last one. Pull your navel in and straighten your arms without shrinking your neck. Then pull gently this bar until your sacrum is touching to the mat. And inhale, pull your navel in and exhale slowly. Come up, then bend your elbows, stack back up. Nice. Now switch your hands, come over hand position, then straighten your legs in front of you. Slightly scooch back or forward because we are rolling down this time all the way, then 
you're gonna your shoulders is coming at the end of the mat okay so from here so nicely sitting top of your sit form then your arms are nicely straight up okay shoulders are really down towards your hip pocket then pull your navel in as you exhale slowly roll down so you're not pulling this bar with your arms your, the arms is rolling down because you are rolling down nicely. Okay, then slowly sacrum is touching, your lower back is touching, then your middle back is touching, then your upper back is coming down. Then gently head down if you are comfortable here, then pushing your bar up over your head. Now feel nice stretching everything good then now bend your elbows and bring your bar forward then same time nod your chin and roll up head and shoulders then reach your bar up then pull your navel in and slowly coming up and stuck back up again again pull your navel and squeeze your inner thighs and connect your pubic bone and navel and upper core. Keep your shoulders away from your ears, then touch your upper back and nicely extending your spine gently, then bring your bar up over your head. Reach, reach, reach. Find a nice comfortable position on your neck and head. Good. Then again. Bring your bench your elbows, then bring back your bar first, then load your chin and slowly roll up from your core. Okay, then slowly coming up. Find a nice beginning position. Let's do two more like that. Keep your shoulders away from your ears, pull your navel in. So no tension, you just your core is nicely working on and put it down your back gently smoothly then once you have a nice extension and stretch you bring your bar up and reach good then slowly bend your elbows inhale nod your chin slowly roll up and exhale come back up all the way good last one tuck your tail under slowly equally your weight is coming down nicely good take your time controlling everything and elongate nicely your spine then once you're extending nicely, bring your bar up and really reaching, reaching, reaching. Good. Then bend your elbows, press the bar gently forward. Same time, nod your chin and curl up in here. Then exhale slowly, coming back up. Good. Okay, so now take the hand down, then turn around, the straddles the a mat. If you can, if you have lower tower, you can put the feet against the football or you can just cross your legs. Okay, it's really up to you. I'm gonna coming, I'm gonna getting the legs wide down. Then come inside of the uh, bar okay then hold this side of the bar with both hands okay then slightly engage your inner thighs okay then you uh, close your ribs together in the middle then bend your elbow then holding nicely then just press the elbow down so just be careful just have enough space behind with the bar Okay, then so with the out, moving the uh, upper shoulders, you just bring your elbow down and 
inhale reaching up nicely okay exhale pull your elbows nicely bending towards your hips then inhale reaching up without hiking anything so your inner thighs all the time engaging okay and pull 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 nicely and inhale and exhale bring back up nice you know that's rotate a little bit of rotation on your elbow okay but keep nice flat back and inhale reaching up exhale pull 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 nicely but without losing this nice upright position on your torso and your inner thighs are all the time engaging good let's do three more pull your elbow towards your hips nicely keep your uh, upper shoulders same height all the time good let's do two more pull your elbows down 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 nicely and inhale reach up so keep your sits bone attached on the floor and pull pull down 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 and inhale relax your arms and shoulders good now just slightly scooch back put your uh, underhand position okay your elbows are facing nicely forward okay still engage your inner side okay then from here just pull your elbow nicely down okay so you close your ribs your pelvis are nicely upright then inhale reach up nicely good again so pull your elbow gently down without having any tension on your neck on your up, upper shoulder and inhale reach up good again pull 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 nicely control good then inhale reach up so i want you to feel this nice um, movement relationship with your elbow and your shoulder and your back okay and up and pull down 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 your spine is nicely neutral and inhale reach up let's do two more pull down 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 your elbow is really heavy down and inhale control and reach up without hiking anything and the last one pull down 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 your elbow is heavy 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 nicely smooth motion and slowly control and reach up good now bring your uh, both feet against the uh, upright let's do a uh, flat back stretch the spine stretch okay so first just press the bar up towards the ceiling okay then just slightly hinging at your hips okay, just to have a nice stretch on your side if your hamstring is really tight then it's hard to keep these straight legs you can slightly bend your knees okay then from here just stack back up and bend your elbows nicely okay then without changing nothing on your spine press your bar straight forward okay then pull your navel in and tuck your tail so tuck your tailbone reaching down okay then just from your crown of the head not your chin and reaching forward okay nice feel nice stretch on your side good then bring your shoulder blade back inhale then exhale 
slowly stack back up, then bend your elbows, then press up, stretch again. So you are bend your elbows, nice upright position. Okay. You're equally weight on the top of your sits bone, then arms are straight. Pull your navel up towards the ceiling. Tuck your chin and the crown of the head reaching straight forward, then reach more forward, forward nicely, but without collapsing on your abdomen. Okay. Then reach, reach, reach. Good, so still keep your nice upright pelvis here. Nicely, your back is quite flat. Okay, then as you inhale, bring your shoulder blades back first. Then stack back up, bend your elbow, then reach up. Good, one more here. So nice, neutral position, bend your elbows and straighten your arms, good. Not touching your crown of the head. Reaching forward, keep your shoulders away from your ears. Reach, reach, reach. Pull your navel back side, but your head is reaching forward. Good. Inhale, bring your shoulder blades back. Then stack back up, bend your elbows. Then reach up, great. Then now, let's add the roll down here. So this time, all the time, keep your arms straight. Reach up first, same way. Then as you exhale, pull your navel in and roll down. Slightly, you are both sits one getting closer. Keep your shoulders away from your ears. Nice, rounding your back. Good, then from here, you engage your armpit down, so press the bar down and not your chin and slowly crown of the head going forward. Still you're not collapsing on your thighs, okay? Pull your navel back in, good. Then as you inhale, slowly pull your navel in, exhale, roll back down again, good. Then inhale, press back up and exhale, stretching nicely. Again, the exhale, pull your navel in the roll down. Good, look at your nose or the bow. Nicely. Okay, then engage your armpit, press down the bar, not your chin and straight forward. Reaching, reaching, reaching. You must feel a nice hamstring stretch too. Good, then as you inhale, start to roll back down, then exhale. Trust the bar and nice roll down, but keep your shoulders away from your ears. Good, then inhale, stack back up, then stretching out, exhale. Good, inhale to prepare. Exhale, roll down. This must be the last time. Okay, and pull your navel in and engage your armpit, and not your chin, and press the bar forward and reach your navel and your head is going in opposite way. Good. Then as you inhale, start to roll back. Keep your shoulders away and control and roll down. Good. Then inhale, reach up, exhale, stretching. Good. So now, bring your right hand a little bit towards the center, okay? Then your left hand going towards your right upright, okay? Then press the bar up, so try to reach your left hand, twist, then your torso going towards your right too, but keep your right shoulder very down, away from your ears, and still keep your nice square hips too, okay? Then as you Inhale, press the bar down and open your left arm to the side and back and reach. But still try to have a nice square hip so both feet are equally attached on the upright. Okay, then keep your right shoulder down. Then 
just come back. Inhale and exhale. Press the bar up and rotate towards your right nicely. But from your uh, bottom side of your ribs. Okay, so it means keep your hips square. Again, inhale and exhale. Open and reach and nicely stretching, but have a square hip. So keep your nice alignment on your spine. Good, then inhale and exhale. Come back to the starting position. Great. Let's do four circle. Inhale, roll, lower the bar down and reach. Good, then now. Uh, Engage your right armpit and press the bar down and you're going towards your right side again. Bend over and reach the bar straight forward and reach, reach, reach. But try to have nice square hips. Great. Then let's uh, unwind the motion. So lift your left arm up and back and bar towards you. Good. Then inhale and exhale, come back to the starting position. Again, pull your navel in and roll down and reach and reaching back, your thrust bar, right shoulder down. Okay, then engage your right armpit and press the bar down and coming up and over towards your right. Good. Have a nice. Stretch and inhale, reverse the motion up and back your left hand. So look at your left fingertips. Good, then press the bar up and swing the hand towards your right. Then reach, reach, reach. Good. Then slowly coming back up. So switch the side. Your left hand on the bar, press up, and your right hand coming towards your left foot or right, left upright. Okay, it's already nice stretch twisting, but still keep your square hips. Good, then inhale, open your arm to the side, then exhale, stretch back, and look at your right hand, okay and trust the bar, keep your left shoulder down. Good, then just come back, inhale and exhale to the starting position. Again, inhale and exhale, reach back nicely. Good, still keep it nice open chest. And inhale and exhale, reach your bar up and coming back. And now let's do full circle twice. Inhale and exhale, side and back. Good, then engage your left armpit, press down the bar up and over towards your left. And reach the bar forward, forward, forward. Good, then inhale, thrust the bar, roll back down and look at your right hand back. You're keeping nice square hips and press the bar up, swing your arm to the side and towards your left. One more, pull your navel in and swing and back your right hand and reach. Very nice, open your upper side, then engage your left armpit, press the bar down and up and over towards your left. Good. Then unwind the motion, inhale, reach your right arm up and back, control and thrust the bar. Okay, still keep your tailbone in the center and press the bar up, swing your arm towards the left and try to reach a little bit more. Good, then coming back to the center. Great. Okay, so let's do leg work a little bit. Okay, so first, put your uh, bar in the middle of the upright, okay? Then put your feet down, so, 
I hope you have this. Uh, if you have a slippery socks, take it off. Okay, and if you have grip socks, hold it nicely, but just control. Okay, if it, this two springs is too heavy, you can have one spring too. Okay, then stra so straighten your legs. Okay, then your uh, bar is really coming in the between the upright. Okay, so your heels or arches on the bar. Okay, still make sure on your alignment and your upper body is nicely relaxed on the floor. Okay, reach your fingertips towards the bar. Okay, keep your shoulders away from your ears. And first, just let's do hamstring curls. So just bend your knees nicely. So without losing your tailbone, okay, on the floor. Exhale, stretching back. Okay, control. Inhale, bend. Nicely, control. So from your navel, you are controlling this movement and exhale, stretching out. Inhale, bend. So controlling, exhale, straight. Good, inhale, bend. Exhale, straight. Okay, so now, as you inhale, bend your knees, then same time, pull your navel into the uh, mat, then lift your butt up, then up. The, so keep your uh, shoulder breath still back down, then when you uh, lift your tailbone and the sits one, reaching up straight, then your legs up, okay? Hold the bar with your feet nicely, and you have a nice straight back in here. Okay, then as you inhale, lift your right foot up, then flex, then slightly kicking towards you, so your knees coming towards your face, but still keep both sits one reaching up, then point your toes, then coming back in, okay? Switch side, so, so slightly lift your left foot, then flex, then kicking, just slightly lower, but without lowering down your butt, then point and come back. So more rhythmically, so kick, kick, and point and back. Flex and kick, and point and back. Flex and kick, point and back. Flex and kick, point and back. So tighten your glutes. Nicely move your legs from the hips. Good, let's do two more each side. Point and back, flex and kick, point and back, flex, kick, long leg without collapsing on your butt and slowly coming back down. Okay, then as you exhale, slowly pull your navel in and lowering your spine one by one. Okay, then slowly bend your knees, then come down, then kick your legs out to the starting position here. So without losing the bar, okay, again. Pull your navel in and bend your knees. Then lift your butt up nicely, equally, both sides. Then straighten your legs up. Okay, then this time, having a nice straight line to keep your neck, back of your neck, really long. Okay, then from here, with out, lowering your butt, just to bend your knees as much as you can, like a uh, squatting and pressing out. So bend, okay, and straight, and bend. Nicely equally using both good, tight, and bend, and straight, so your core is nicely engaged. So kind of like your uh, torso, uh, 
like sandwiched from the back and front and the straight. Let's do two more bend without shrinking anything and up and bend and up and this time bend your knees nicely. Then slowly pull your navel in and roll down, roll down. Your bar is coming with you because, but it, you're not pushing down with your feet because you just you're lowering down, your bar is coming together. Okay, then pull your navel in, controlling and straightening your legs out. Good. Okay, so now just secure your feet over the bar. Okay, then reach your arms up towards the ceiling. Okay, and nod your chin. And slowly head and shoulders curl up and pull your navel in and roll up. Find the bar with your both hands, the major knees, okay? Then very point so toes and balls of the feet are touched on this on this bar, okay? Then so straighten your legs and nice you have a stretch. Then flex your ankle, okay. Yes. So let's have a more stretching on this back side and point and stretch and flex. Point and flex. Good. Then point and flex. And your knees are bending more and kick out too. So bend your knees and straighten your legs. Let's do two more. Bend and stretch. Good. Keep your shoulders away from your ears. Still pull your navel back into your spine. Good. Then slowly bend your knees. Put your one foot down and the other foot coming together. Straighten your legs. Lift your bar up. Good. Okay. So now turn around. Okay. Let's do some teaser bar. Okay. So. Lay down on your back with the bar. Okay. So anytime if you need uh, have a break, stop the video and have a break. Take some water or something. Okay. As I like, let's keep doing with me this teaser. Okay. So so your bar. So your arms are straight. You are nicely on your back and kind of like your nose are coming just under the bar position, okay? Your legs are, okay, so your legs are bending and into the tabletop position here, okay? So first let's do modified teaser, so with, uh, without stretching your legs, okay? So holding nicely this bar, just gently wider than shoulder width, Okay, then knock, it, knock your chin and curl up, then slowly push the bar up and coming up to the modified teaser position. Okay, means your knees are still bending. Okay, and pull your navel in without sh you know, shrinking your neck. You just gently roll down, still elongating your spine, then coming down all the way. So if you have a rest, if you want to have a rest, put your feet down. Okay. And again, lift your legs up into the tabletop position. Okay. Then slowly come up and peel your spine off from the mat. Then Nicely reach your arms up without hiking your shoulders. Still pull your navel into your spine without extending your lower back. Good. Then again, inhale and exhale. Slowly from the bottom, put it down gently on the floor. Okay. Take your time and equally evenly stretching nicely your spine then coming down good okay. so now if you like let's do the teaser okay with your straight with your straight legs 
Okay. You can first have a tabletop position. Okay. Then you have to prepare. Okay. As you exhale, lift your shoulder brace up, then not your chin and inhale and exhale. Come up and straighten your legs up and keep it together. Nice. Good. Then I just as you exhale, pull your navel in and roll down. So unwind the motion, control, and bend your knees. And slowly your head is coming down. And come down all the way. Reset. Again. Inhale, tighten your core and pelvic floor. And exhale, not your chin. And slowly coming up and straight. Everything. Good, then now this time you are just four times lower down your legs. So you, you can, if it's too much, you can keep modified or you, you can completely down too, okay? Otherwise, if you can, you just fall lower down and exhale from your core lifting up. Three, good. Keep your bar, same position, and no tension on your shoulders. And last one, lower, and exhale up, and slowly pull your elbow in and lower the upper body down, but from the bottom, controlling everything. Good. Then your upper back touching, bend your knees, and your head is coming down. Two. Okay. Then now, come back again. If it's too much, you can do, just keep your feet down and come up, or just modify, okay? Or if you can't, just from here, chin up and coming up all the way, okay? So if you're here, it's fine too. So this time, keep your, so legs are lower down. Same time, your back is lower down. So each side equally, so inhale, and exhale, come up. Pull your navel in, and come up. Two more, pull your navel in, and lower, and reach, and come up. Last one, control, and elongate your spine, so put your lower back down, and exhale, come up, and slowly lower down your back with control, Keep your shoulders away from your ears. And as your upper back is touching, bend your knees and slowly put your head down. You can put your feet down to, okay, good. Let's do one more here. Into the tabletop position, all feet down, okay, and inhale. Not your chin and exhale, come up. If you can just straighten your legs. If you cannot, you can just keep down or bend. Okay, then from here, even your feet down, bring your, so if you're straightened, just bend your knees and twisting your knees, but without lifting, so rotating your hips. Keep your hips still in square as possible. Then. Coming back to the center and reach. So bend and twist slightly. Your side of your hip come up, but so still try to keep it down. Your intention it matters. Then straight. So you bend and twist side to side and straight. So now going to your left and straight. Still keep your waistline nearly long and straight. And last one, bend and straight. So if you can keep holding it, then as you bend your knees and you're twisting towards your right, so your torso is going lower down on your left. Okay? And slowly coming up to the center. Everything is coming center. Then now your left, your knee is going to your left and your Bodies slightly rolling down towards your right and the center. So you must feel your obliques nicely and twist and down and the center and the left and your uh, 
two, so it's nicely rotated on your right. And the center, one more each, twist, opposite way. And your knees are going to your left and your torso rotate towards your right. And the center, and slowly roll down on your back. And elongate your spine, keep your armpit engaged. Then your back is coming down and bend your knees and slowly lower down your head, put your feet down and press the bar out and your legs out to stretching, stretching, stretching. Good, and slowly bring your bar up and don't your chin and come up nicely. So now take one spring out. So I have only one blue spring from the top. Okay, then let's do swan here. So press down the bar all the way between the uprights and coming on your stomach. Put your hands, both hands on, and when you straighten your arms, keep the bar between the upright nicely. Your legs are just comfortably wide. Put your pubic bone down and your hip bone is even and nicely down, same way. Okay, then really pointing your toes, reaching back. Okay, so without losing your pelvis from the floor. Okay, as you inhale, press the bar down, then lift your chest up. Okay, then your bar just coming, so just pour a little bit of your bar towards you, then nicely come up. Good, so look at your nose, okay, and inhale, and exhale, slowly lower down. Good. So find a comfortable position on your shoulders, okay, listen to your body. You don't need to come up high, okay, just play with this bar and your spine. Okay, so press down the bar, inhale. Slowly lift your chest, the bone up. Keep your, bring your shoulder blades back and into your spine. Nicely, good. And inhale at the top. Exhale, slowly lower down, down, down. And the crown of the head, really nicely reaching forward. Again. Inhale, press the bar down and pull towards you a little bit so that help you to come up nicely and gently squeeze your bra line, and, but keep your pelvis nicely equally down on the mat and inhale and exhale all down smoothly. Last one, press down and slowly, gently bring your shoulder blades back and come up. And inhale and exhale. Reach your toes back and your crown of the head going forward. Good. Okay, let's do a little bit of swimming on your legs. So halfway, press down the bar and come up halfway. Okay, still comfortable, but slightly engaging your back. Then both legs slightly, both feet hover up from the grooves. Okay, then just swim, so lower one leg and switch. Switch, breathe. Good, right, left, good. So it's not for coming from your lower back, it's only from your glutes. And up. switch, breathe. Good, quickly, switch, 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 switch. Good, nice long leg, right, left, right, left, good. And four, three, two, and one. And as you exhale, slowly lower down. Good, then slowly put your one hand down, then with the other hand, reach your uh, bar up. Then coming into the child's pose here. Your toes up together, knees are nicely wide and Lower down your tailbone towards the heels. Good, and reach your both arms gently walking forward. 
Shin the breeze deeply. Good. Then inhale, pull your navel in and exhale slowly. Come up. Good. Then slowly stand up. Okay, then facing to the side. My right hand is close to my bar, so just coming like, you know, just my right hand is slightly forward and on the bar, okay? Both the legs, both feet are nicely attached here and it's nice square hips and my pelvis and ribs are nicely upright position. Okay, then arms are quite straight. Then, as you, so reach your left arm to the side. Then your weight is equally both feet. Okay, then inhale, press the bar down. Then exhale, just lift your left arm up and over and nicely side bending. But still keep your uh, left butt Engage and connect with your right butt, so not pushing back, okay? So really, everything is nicely up and over. Good. Then inhale and exhale, come up. Now, a little bit bend your elbow, then go close to the bar. Okay, then press the bar down. This time, shift your weight on your right leg, okay? Keep your left shoulder very down. Okay, then reach your left leg to the side. Still nice, flat hips, okay? Pelvis, uh, no rotation, okay? Then really you, uh, tighten your right glutes, okay? Then inhale, lift your left leg up. So you can hold with your right left hand around your waist or you can reach out. So you have to you and holding my, around my waist. Then slowly, low, inhale, lower leg, and exhale up, shh. Inhale, lower, exhale up, shh. So without too much leaning on the, my right side, okay? This part is nice support, but I'm not leaning too much, okay? Still, my core are nicely engaged, and my spine, uh, Nicely diagonally reaching up, exhale up, inhale lower, exhale up, inhale lower, exhale up. Then next time lifting up, nicely then make a small circle. Soften your right knee, okay? Then in this circle, it's coming into the hip socket, so not, you're not rotating your hips. Three, two, one and reverse. Nice. Good. So I'll go back. Yes. It's four. Three, two, one, and reach. And slowly bring your feet together and slightly lift the bar up. Step a little bit to go outside. Then bring your left foot back side of the right foot. Then one more side bending this way. So you must feel the nice hip stretch on your left side this time, but without crunching on your right side either. And breathe. Right shoulder very down and very rigid your left fingertips over the right side. Good, then inhale and exhale, come up. Nice, let's switch side. Okay, so my left hand a little bit in front of my shoulder. Left shoulder is really away from your ears. Okay, then reach my right arm out, then up and over to the side. Nice side stretch, okay. Engage your right butt, connect with your left sit bone and the right sit bone together. 
Okay, nice square hips. Nothing is rotating. Good. Then inhale and exhale, come up. Now slightly close to the, towards the bar. Okay, then this time your left glutes are nicely engaged. Okay, then slight, so bring your right leg out. Hold the bar steady, okay? Then inhale, reach your left leg. So right leg up, okay? Then tighten here, everything. Then inhale, lower your leg and exhale up. Lower and up using the side of your glutes. Nice. Up, breathe. Good. Soften your left knee. Good. Point down your right toe and up. Long leg up. Three. Up. Two. Reach, last one, and up and hold. Keep your left shoulder away from your ears and make a circle, circle, small, because your pelvis is uh, very quiet. Good, and three, two, one, and reverse your circles. Nice, long leg, good, great. So without collapsing on your left side, really reaching up and two and one and reach and slowly squeeze your inner thighs and come up. Slightly step out, then bring your right foot back. Okay, then press down the bar and right up, up and over. Okay, and nicely. Our side bending, very stretching on your side without collapsing. Good, then inhale and exhale, coming back. Good, and now have a parallel legs again facing the bar. Okay, then this time just straighten your arms in front of you. Okay, so stay in nice neutral position and roll. let's do roll down. Not your chin, soft on your knees and as you exhale from your crown of the head, roll down, roll down, roll down. Good. Then now, as you inhale, bring your shoulder blades back and like a, like a cow pose, so squeeze your shoulder blades back and lift your chest bone up, flat back, but keep your weight on over your heels, okay? Then as you exhale, roll down, nice. Again, inhale, squeeze your shoulder blades back and in the center and lift it nice, your chest bone up, keep your tailbone back, good. Then as you exhale, roll down. Good. Then exhale, pull your navel in and slowly, gently articulating your spine and slowly pull your navel in and coming up, up, up. Good. Press the bar down once more, then gently squeeze your shoulder blades. Keep your gently ribs in the center. Okay, then Pull your uh, collarbone to the side nicely, then slightly open your chest and bring your head slightly back but still reaching up. Good. And your, hip, your hips uh, stay over your heels. Good. Then slowly coming up. Put the, uh, take the spring out of the bar, okay, then hold the upright, like a shoulder height, both hands, okay, then tent both feet against the upright, okay, then you exhale, push your butt back, okay, then just for, for your navel is still engaging, then bend, so just to swing your uh, hips side to side, We'll have a nice low back 
stretch, good, three, nice, and we're coming back to the center, then pull your navel in, round first, then coming into your flat back, then nicely extending your spine, so if your head is and the neck is okay, you can just a little bit going back, but still engage your glute tight. Good. Then slowly knock your chin and coming back. Again, push your hips back out. Okay. Bend your knee this time and nice, feel a nice deep stretching, even on your inner thighs and glutes. Good. So one more each side. Great, then coming back to the center, pushing back, then pull your navel in, round your lower back first, then come up straight flat, then extending nicely. Good. But make sure you're not very go, okay? So you still control everything. Good. Then slowly bring your chin down, reach your head up, and bend your elbows and coming up. And then we are done for today. Thank you so much for joining me today. If you have any question or request, <coughs> please leave a comment below. And if you enjoyed the workout, please subscribe to the channel so that I'm gonna make more on Pilates workout videos for you guys. Thank you and see you soon. Bye.